question number nine it says in the diagram eh is an arc of a circle center q fh is a tangent to the circle at h and qf is a straight line the length of line segment qh is equal to 8 root 3 centimeters and angle eqh is equal to 60 degrees calculate the length of line segment ef so let's tackle this part so the line the length of line segment e h e f we can use trigonometry because the tangent f h and q and the radius q h will form a 90 degree angle we meet at 90 degree so the, using the cosine ratio cos 60 degrees will be equal to uh, adjacent which is 8 root 3 over the hypotenuse which is qf and qf is made up of qe which is also 8 root 3 because the red radii are equal in length so 8 root 3 plus the length of ef line segment ef so cos 60 is 1 over 2 and that is equal to 8 root 3 over 8 root 3 plus line segment ef the modulus or the magnitude so let's cross multiply this will multiply 1 to give us 8 root 3 plus magnitude of line segment EF um, is equal to 2 times 8 root 3 which is 16 root 3. So we subtract 8 root 3 from both sides. Magnitude of line segment EF will be equal to 16 root 3 minus 8 root 3. And that will give us 8 root 3 centimeters. We are also asked to find correct to three significant figures the area of the shaded portion. So to do that, let us first find the length of FH. We know HQ, we know QF. Let's with FH. So from Pythagoras theorem, F H squared F H squared plus A to three squared will be equal to eight root three plus eight root three, which is sixteen root three all squared and this will simplify to 8 root 3 squared will give us when we simplify that we will obtain so this will give us 16 root 3 16 root 3 all squared minus 8 root 3 all squared. I'm going to apply difference of 2 square here. Difference of 2 squares. So that will give me 16 root 3 plus 8 root 3 into bracket 16 root 3 minus 8 root 3. So when we simplify this, we are going to obtain root 3 into 16 plus 8, which is 24. Then we also get root 3 into 16 minus 8, which is 8. 
So we are going to get root 3 times root 3 is, is 3 times 8 is 24 times 24. So we are obtaining 24 squared. So FH, FH, all squared is equal to 24 squared. So FH will be equal to square root of 24 squared. Magnitude of FH. And that will give us 24 centimeters. So since FH is 24 centimeters, we can now calculate the area of the shaded region. So the area of the shaded region will be equal to the area of the triangle QHF minus area of sector. So area of shaded region will be equal to area of triangle, which is half times base times height minus area of sector theta over 360 times pi r squared. So the base is 24. The base is 24 centimeters and the height is 8 root 3. So that will give us 1 over 2 times 24 times 8 root 3 minus theta. Theta is 60. So we have 60 over 360 times 22 over 7 times pi the pi is 22 over 7 times radius square 8 root 3 all squared so this will give us remember that 2 will go here 12 times so that will give us 96 root 3 minus 1 over 6 times 22 over 7 times a square is 64 times root 3 square is 3 so this will simplify to 96 root 3 minus 704 over 7 and this will simplify to 65.7054 three significant figures we have one two three so three significant figures will be six five point seven the next number is zero so you can run up centimeter squared